In one of the biggest mass executions in decades, Saudi Arabia executed 81 men on Saturday, which included seven Yemenis and one Syrian. And the number of executed this year has surpassed the 67 executions that took place in the kingdom in 2021. Saudi Arabia's interior ministry further issued a statement which read, and I quote, These individuals totaling 81 were convicted of various crimes, including murdering innocent men, women and children. The statement also said that crimes committed by these individuals also include pledging allegiance to foreign terrorist organizations. Now, according to state news agency SPA, the latest group had been tried by 13 judges and gone through a three-stage judicial process. Out of the 81 men executed, 73 of them were Saudi nationals who were found guilty in a single case for attempting to assassinate security officers and targeting police stations and convoys. The latest mass execution in the kingdom is likely to bring back attention to Saudi Arabia's human rights record. And it comes at a time when the world powers have been focused on Russia's invasion of Ukraine. Meanwhile, rights groups have accused Saudi Arabia of enforcing restrictive laws on political and religious expression and has been criticized for using death penalty, including for defendants who were arrested when they were minors. However, Saudi Arabia has denied accusations of human rights abuses by further asserting that it is only protecting its national security through its laws. The wealthy Gulf has one of the highest execution rates in the world. It is ranked fifth in a list compiled by the Amnesty International. The other four countries are China, Iran, Egypt and Iraq. We On is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.